Well guys, it seems like Charleston White has finally met his match with Rick Ross a baby mama Tia Kemp. Now you guys know that both of these two individuals are very blunt, nonchalant, and they don't care what they say. So you guys know Tia be blasting Rick Ross all over social media. Well this morning, Charleston White had some words for her. Hey, good morning everybody. Uh, I just want to say this. Uh, any black woman that got a baby by a black man that they get online every day and go after your kid's father. You have to remember the things that you say about your children's father or your children's mother. You picked them. You laid down with that person. So as you talk about your children's mother and your father, you're actually talking about your children because they have the same chromosomes. Auntie now y'all know Tia Kim was go clap back and here's what she had to say to Charleston White. Hey, Charleston White. The way I'm finna line your bullwinkle cockeyed ass up, dog, on YouTube, you gon' wish you ain't mention my motherfucking name, fuck boy. Listen here, bitch nigga. I said what the fuck I said, and I'm calling a spade a spade, just like your bitch ass do, pussy. Let me tell you something, bitch. The way I'm finna get you together on YouTube, oh man, I been waiting on this. Cause you turned down that motherfucking goddamn seat on the podcast, fuck boy. Why you ain't come see the aunties on the podcast, nigga? We had you out there. You backed out. Bitch, I know you ain't talking about your auntie. Hey, man, y'all better go subscribe to my YouTube now. Cause when I come back, it's on YouTube, fuck boy. I'm finna give you the business. You done met your motherfucking match. Bullwinkle. So Tia Caption says, Charleston White, it's up, Bullwinkle. Go subscribe to my YouTube, the link in my bio. Later tonight, I'm going live, plastic eye B word. Ain't these rap ninjas you be playing with, clout chasing P word, B word. She then posted on Instagram stories and says, Oh, you cocked eye A done unfollow me now, huh? I can't mention you, D Rider. So Tia then posted on her Instagram story and her Instagram that she believes that Charleston White got her post deleted from her Instagram. No oh, puss ass, your bitch ass had to report my post, huh, fuck boy? You fuck boy, you better get my son off your motherfucking page, man. I make him pancake your bitch ass, hold your bitch ass down so I can kick that eye at your fucking head, boy. After that, Charleston started saying something about Rick Ross and Tia Kim's son. And then next thing you know, he posted and said, Tia tried to book me for an interview four weeks ago. I reject that Rod and B and the Zeus Network. I ain't doing ish with them sour hearted B words was my exact response to their producer. He then reposted this on his Instagram story and said, my admiration and respect for Rick Ross and my compassion for William Jr. I won't involve him. I'll stick to the subject matter. His bitter black rotten a mama. He then posted a picture of William Jr. and he had his chest out and Charleston says Tia Kemp look at this I'm going to rename Titty Boy who mama got the big teeth boy got his mama nipples and his daddy breast <laughs> But you guys know Tia and Charleston can go all day and all night. Somebody in the comment section even said Tia versus Charleston White is like Godzilla versus King Kong. But anyways, you guys let me know your thoughts and opinions on this down in the comment section below. Make sure you guys like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell. And I will talk to you guys in the next video.